Good morning, everyone. Good morning to you guys from Bodrum. I just woke up not long ago. And I'm kind of semi-prepared to go for breakfast. I can't see anything, so I'm just going to continue talking, thinking, assuming I can see myself. Oh my God, I can't. Wait, it's too bright. Okay, one, two, three. There we go. Okay, cool. So, it's my birthday. And I'm going to have breakfast at this really cool spot. I've been at a beach every day since I've been here. But today I don't really want to go to a beach. I want to chill by our own pool. I have dinner at 9 at the Bodrum Edition. And then probably go out after. If we have the energy. So that's the D-Lo. It's like only 9am. And this is the plan for today. I don't know if I'll go to the hairdressers to get my hair done. Maybe. I'm just thinking if I'm bothered. Right now, because it's really hot, I can't think straight. Wait, let me just look normal for a second and get this clip out. Um, this is my friend's a stunning view and this is Bodrum for you. People don't really know about Bodrum much, but it's like Mykonos or Santorini, a mixture of both. We find super luxury and also find super chilled in one place. So you could stay at a seven star hotel, but then also have Airbnb. I have some new neighbors that moved in the other day. These houses are quite big actually, but it looks so small. Anyway, I need to I need to get out of the sun for two seconds. I'm gonna get back to you guys. This is my bre oh wait, hold on. Let me show you guys my um birthday dress. My breakfast dress and then I have my lunch dress and then I have my dinner dress and then I don't know if you guys saw that and then this really cute little spot called Zaytini now and we're here to have breakfast. This is the set out. The food is really good, like the breakfast. And we're definitely gonna have Sadna, which is like a traditional Turkish breakfast where you have a lot of things scattered on the table in small quantities. So you've got a hell of a selection. Before I start eating and ruining the um, setup, I just want to show you guys, this is what it is. Fried eggs, um, berek, different types of berek, fishy, um, soj, olives, cherry, different types of cheese. Potatoes with tomato sauce. Mujraj. So when I get old and wrinkly and the beauty is all gone, I hope my, my partner and me could do what they're doing like that. Isn't that amazing? That's a second. Oh, I want to be like you guys. They remind me of my mum and dad. Huh? They remind me of my mum and dad. My mum and dad would be, like, they're like cat and dog. Food in the beach was all right, but yesterday was not great. The drinks weren't yeah. good. We went to... Um, Thingies, um, Lucas' food was the best so yeah. far. Yeah. yeah. But don't you think Mia, 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 Mia? Mia's food was okay. Luca, okay. Luca's food. Nigerian. Yeah, like the, what did we have in that? Because they had like, where did we have the acai? Luca. Both places. Yeah, we had it in Luca. Yeah, mm -hmm. I liked that. Yeah. So now we are going back to Bika. And <laughs> John's broke her slippers yesterday. I don't know why. God. But we need to get some um, Havianas. 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 Look at it. I know this fish. 
Biz aslında bugün şeyli yapmamız gerekiyor. Sen sırrağını falan... Ya sen sırrağını falan burada yaptırmayacaksın değil mi? I mean, I could do, but I feel nauseous, so I'd rather just. I, I'll, I need to see how I feel after I just lay down for a bit first. Okay. I would like to, yeah. Ama bu da yaptırıyor musun? Çeşmede mi yapıyorsun? Ben çeşme diye düşünüyorum. Zaten üç günümüz, dört günümüz yok. They were leaving in two days. Yeah, I might just do it in çeşme. Then I don't know where in çeşme that's the thing. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Go and show them your outfit. Oh, bitch. Cute. <laughs> right, she said. Hotel, and they have three restaurants in this place. There's the Asian restaurant, there's the Italian restaurant, but we're in the Asian one, and it's called Inari. It's sushi and steak. We had, I thought we were gonna have sushi, but we both wanted the steak, and it was delicious. If you come here, make sure you order. What was it that we ordered? Ribs, steak. Ribs, steak, um, noodles, spicy noodles, spicy noodles, noodles sticky rice. rice. The best was the steak. So if you're into meat, it's a good option to come here and have a beautiful um, evening dinner. Or if you want sushi, they've got amazing sushi. Like look at those guys over there working their ass off making great sushi. I think this hotel is stunning. I'm not staying here, but I think next time I would want to stay. But wouldn't you want to chill? It is, I know. So it's catering for anyone and everyone, really. But if you did want to come here and spend a really chilled holiday, they have their own beach. I think it's a five-star hotel anyway, so it's a shout. Bodrum edition. And this is... Come in. This is going to go in my vlog, by the way. Happy birthday! I'm not too sure about this dessert. Nasıl yani? Çok güzel gözüküyor da bir saniye. Guys, I just need to take a picture of my friend in one second. The ones where you're looking over the stairs, over your shoulder is really They're nice. They're terrible. <laughs> They're the worst. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I have to say, this guy's been showing off since we got here in a jet ski. He's cutting shapes and doing all sorts. All right. He's on full talent. <laughs> We're at this beach called um, Kum Pilaj, and it's really nice. You could have your own private little area here, jump into the pool privately, and then it's like this. It's not even fully packed. I'm not going on with him at all. Yeah, he's doing all sorts. Look, he's riding with his foot. Okay, Mr. Show Off. Look at that. I don't know why I'm telling you guys these details, but I think it's important to know. I don't really like sandy beaches because I feel uncomfortable with like sand on my toes and dry foot. Let me just take this back. By the way, I must say these Crocs with a platform are the most comfortable thing I've ever bought and they're so cute to wear. Jay's just with a Brazilian black. 
in Turkey. I don't know. I um, we went to Kumrich yesterday, spelled K-U-U-M, in Yovakovak, and it's really nice. We liked it so much that we're going again today. And tomorrow we are moving to our next destination, so it's our last day, last night here. We're going to miss this view. So I got up ages ago, got ready, brushed my teeth, watered the plants, made us coffee. Jay's still getting ready. This girl takes forever. There was a really small earthquake last night at around 2.30 a.m. I was in a deep sleep. Jay was just about to fall asleep, so she must, she obviously felt it before me and she was like, there's an earthquake. Really calmly, by the way. But because I was in my deep sleep and I heard that, I woke up unnaturally. My heart was pulsating and my body started shaking out of control. You know, when someone wakes you up from your deep sleep, you're like, oh, you know, it was uncomfortable. Anyway, she was like, it's still going on. I was like, are you sure? She was like, yeah. So I had to calm myself down to then, you know, be steady to feel the earthquake and the bed was shaking. So we checked this morning, there was three really small um, earthquakes at the magnitude of 2.1, 1.6, three different earthquakes in three different areas of Turkey, but it's below the Aegean Sea, so. And it's quite natural that there's earthquakes here. Apparently there's like 30 to 50 a day, 365 days of the year, but it's okay. It's not a life risk, but it's really small. It doesn't really do anything to the country or anyone. The earthquake that happened back in February was huge. God forbid it. No one would want to experience that. That was terrible. So as long as it's really small ones, the country's fine. If it's big, then I don't even know what to say. But that happened last night. Over it, we're fine. I'm in this cute little bikini. The beach that we went to yesterday was stunning. The food was great. The drinks were great. The location's great. Staff, great quite elite they do everything for you as long as you pay of course but um everything was really nice i really enjoyed that beat so we're going there again today we were going to go much because but we couldn't get a last minute reservation yes darling seni bekliyorum seni bekliyorum hazır mısın sen Back to the marina and we're gonna go into Baby Tower, but we're late. I didn't show you guys what I'm wearing. I will now, partially. by Yalakavak Marina, you speak to a man like Mehmet, who would look after you, right? You keep it just particular. Okay, God, he's walking us out, making sure we'll get to our car, okay? Okay. <laughs> 
Hi, how are you? Is that YouTube? 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 Check it out. Pablo. Come to Yalukawa and you come to park your car in the main car park. This is the guy who's going to greet you. He's so hungry. Aynen öyle niye geliyorsunuz tersten? One way orası. Girl! I'm done. This is what it looks like. Uh. It's meant to be thin, but it's so dark. And uh, you need this. Although it seems nice from a distance, the reality is if it's just posting about you just like that, then it's posting about everyone just like that. Today we are departing to our next destination. Just waiting for Jay to come out from the house. And oh shoot, I forgot this. I'll just put my suitcase in the car. Standing outside.